What's up everyone? Welcome to my quick tutorial on how to get Engine Mod 12 Android version 5.0.2 on the stock ROM slot in SafeStrap Recovery. So what you have to do now is uh, root your phone. I have a tutorial for that, for the stock ROM slot, uh, when you're in stock ROM actually. And then you have to download the recovery from the description below, which is SafeStrap Recovery 3.75. And you have to download the ROM you want to install, which is the latest Synergy Mod Nightly, Synergy Mod 12, and the G apps you want to install. So let's pretend this is the stock ROM slot uh, with the stock ROM on it. This is obviously Synergy Mod, but let's pretend this is stock. So when it's stock, install the recovery and uh, grant it super user permissions and then reboot. reboot and when you have successfully installed the recovery um, now the splash screen or whatever it's called will appear and you can uh, choose between going on to, uh, to boot the ROM or to enter the recovery which is the menu key here let's check it out uh, after the boot logo it will appear And um, yeah, it will be very important to make a backup of your current stock ROM slot because now you can see um, menu for recovery. Um, you have to have a backup of your current um, stock ROM system because sometimes there can be issues with stock ROMs. Um, they can delete, actually, they can delete. Um, the recovery and then when something goes wrong you can't enter recovery so what you have to do now we are in stock ROM slot as you can see right here this is safe strap recovery 3.75 and what you have to do now is back up Android secure data and system make sure you back up it so you can restore it if you have issues like you can see here i've made a backup of my stock rom slot which is the um, original uh, moto roller firmware the um, stock experience um, now make sure again double check that you're in stock rom slot then you can when you have made a backup it's Obviously, you can do whatever you want now. Uh, wipe, wipe data, cache, and Dalvik. That's the right thing, right thing to do. Um, swipe to factory reset. Do that, and then go to install, and then find your uh, files you have downloaded, um, which is in my case the Sanjay Mod 12, Nightly, and the G apps uh, Lollipop from the 9th of November. Uh, make sure you hit them both, add more zips, and go for G apps lollipop. Then swipe to confirm flash. It will take a while. It says morning stock install. This operation may install incompatible uh, software and render your device unusable. Uh, you can do that. Just install it because we have made a backup. Remember that. Um, then you can go to reboot if you have installed it. Reboot system. And when the splash screen appears, you can go to skip. And the first boot will take a while, so don't worry, guys. Uh, just wait like five minutes and it will boot. So here you can see that we can actually search to continue. And now you can uh, watch the boot animation of Synergy Mod 12. So yeah, this is my quick guide on how to get Synergy Mod 12 working on the uh, stock ROM slot, which is actually pretty cool because you get um, better RAM handling and better um, storage 
storage uh, administration of the device. So everything will be a lot smoother and um, you have more space, more user space. You can download more apps and um, don't have to mess around with the cache. So when you create a ROM slot and um, say strap uh, 3.75, you have actually you can actually choose how much cache, how much um, uh, data you want to have. So the partitions you can you can change, and the stock ROM slot handles that um, itself by itself. So yeah, you have uh, more advantages over the other ROM slots, and um, now you can enjoy Sanjay Mod 12 on your device. Camera works great, and um, if you want to know more about Sanjay Mod 12 on the Razer, you can check out my um, full review on the ROM, which is also available on my channel. Um, just search for Sanjay Mod 12 uh, CM12 Razer ROM, and you will find it.